time, it's going to be like, all right. Uh, it will give every give a more perspective on how many people now, are you here. Want my, you want profile side? You Don't want you have all good sides? It would be introspective, and or do you want straight off? Hmm. You want straight off? Straight off. I feel like if we were sitting down and like I have my legs crossed and just like. I don't know, smoking a pipe, maybe a profile shop would work, but... Scar going. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, let's get it on. All right. So, the first question is, before coming to class, what were your expectations and what were you uh, anticipating to learn here? But to be honest, my one of the big things I was wanting to take away from the class was the odor mitigation aspect of it, because mm -hmm. that's a part of my company that I'm wanting to grow. Once I got here, and started seeing the other pieces of the mold, the remediation, the moisture control, and everything that goes in together with that, it has opened my eyes and it has broadened my horizons for what else my company can do. So what my, my expectations, you know, when I got here on Monday, I thought they were up here. I realized by about Tuesday afternoon, in reality, my expectations were down here but on Friday, they have so exceeded what I wanted to get out of the course. Awesome. So, by saying that, it means that you enjoyed the course. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, okay. Absolutely, yeah. All yeah. right. Yeah, that's uh, great to hear. Um, so, well, going back into that, uh, do you think there's any other ways on, like, getting people to understand, like, what this course is? is? Uh, before they actually come up because again uh, your expectations no you got you guys presented the course and when I look back and I mean you laid out the syllabus mm -hmm. you showed everything that we were going to cover it was just from my personal personal understanding on no my or, personal ignorance of what was going on okay so I was so cone focused on one thing mm -hmm. that the other other products and other services that we covered this week really weren't on my radar. Mm -hmm. And now that I've kind of seen what, what is out there, talked to other contractors that were here and inter interacted with them, it has now broadened my horizons. Uh, again, I am not uh, I am not an Advanta Clean. Mm -hmm. franchise. I'm not a mold and remediate remediation specific. I'm a general contractor. Mm -hmm. I do a little bit of everything. Mm -hmm. So it has broadened my horizons on what I can do. Okay. Uh, you said that coming in you were focused on chlorine dioxide. Uh, like no, that's, I said or, coming in I was focused on odor mitigation. Odor mitigation. Don't put words in no. my mouth, Jeff. Uh, I'm letting you talk as <laughs> good. Awesome. Uh, uh, did you have a favorite part of the course or something that sticked out to you? Odor mitigation, odor mitigation. <laughs> you no, the best part of this course mm -hmm. was the interaction with the other contractors from around the country. Mm -hmm. I, I learned a lot in the course. Mm -hmm. Okay. So what I'm mm -hmm. getting ready to say, please don't think it takes away from the course. I learned more interacting with the other contractors that were here. Mm -hmm. So just the interaction in the classroom and the interaction outside of the classroom with the other contractors mm -hmm. has has taught me and, and, and it goes right along with what Mark was teaching mm -hmm. and what the other guys were teaching as we brought it all together because obviously what we were talking about as contractors was bridging off what we were talking about in the classroom mm -hmm. so it, it was it went hand in hand but my favorite part of the course was meeting contractors from other part of the country mm -hmm. I didn't have to worry about um, I'm talking to a competitor. Mm -hmm. They're not from my area. So we could speak freely about, hey, how do you price that? Mm -hmm. Hey, how are you guys doing this? How are you selling this in your market? What's your marketing technique? And we're free to share those ideas with each other because I'm not worried about someone's going to take my idea and steal it. Mm -hmm. I'm not worried about someone's going to, oh, that's how you're pricing that in your market. I think we'll do this and undercut you just a little bit so we can beat your price and get your business. I feel like I could speak freely here with everyone. And, and my impression was everybody else felt the same way. So my favorite part of the course was the interaction with other contractors from around the, around the nation that were here 
that are going through the same boat as mm -hmm. I am. Like going through the same thing in the same boat as I am as we're trying to, we're all trying to do the same thing. Mm -hmm. We're all trying to build our business and mm -hmm. provide the best customer service we can to the end user. So it's great to be able to interact with everybody, hear their ideas, see what they're doing, see what's worked, see what hasn't worked, mm -hmm. and go down that road. No, that's a great compliment for the course, I believe, because it's still within the confine. If we didn't have the initial course to begin with, to bring all the guys here and to talk that way, uh, that interaction would have never happened. Sure, absolutely. Uh, absolutely. So, again, it is a plus. Like, in my mind, it is a plus. Yeah, so, yeah. Okay, good. Um, going into... Uh, when you go back home, what would you, after from what you learned from the course, what would you implement uh, relatively uh, soon? It's, it's going to take me a little bit to unpackage everything that I've picked up here in a week. Mm -hmm. So I can't tell you that next week I'm going to do this. Um, it's going to take me a little bit to digest everything. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm a small company, all right? Um, I'm looking to grow, and mm -hmm. it's going to take me a little bit to put the pieces together from the marketing to the um, staffing side to the you know, just everything that goes to grow in my company. Mm -hmm. It's going to take me a little bit to put those pieces together. Now, having said that, I have already posted to my, my business Facebook page the mm -hmm. odor mitigation uh, flyer. I did that sitting right in there just a few minutes ago. Mm -hmm. So that's already out. Hopefully over the next week it's going to reach, um, I think we're, we're going to boost it out, and I hope we're going to reach 10,000 people, which is not a lot of people in the Charlotte region. Mm -hmm. But that is our goal, to reach 10,000 people in the Charlotte region with that. So Just with, with one document. With now. one document, with my information on it, my mm -hmm. contact information, just that snapshot of the odor mitigation. So. What's one thing I've done immediately? I've already done that before I even left Banner Elk. Uh, but mm -hmm. it's gonna take me a little bit to unpackage and formulate a business plan where I can take everything to the next step. Because where I am in my business, um, I want to implement all these things. I know I can't do all of them. Yeah. I want to start with some of them. So I've got to figure out- At least which, get the ball rolling. I want to figure out what I'm gonna start with. And then it's gonna, the next piece is going to be staffing, and then it's going to be taking it to the next level. So mm -hmm. that's where I'm at. No, that's, again, everyone has different, uh, I don't want to say issues, but different things that they have to deal with to get to uh, the sure. point that they want Absolutely. to get to. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. okay. Absolutely. And let me just speak to this. Mm -hmm. You haven't asked this question. I am not a franchise. I can't pull on a franchise for any type of support in this area. Mm -hmm. So, you guys here in the office, uh, Mark and you and, uh, you know, Ange is it Angela? Angelina. Angelina. My apologies, Angelina. Um, you guys have provided a, a support network for me as an independent contractor. With all the, all the promotional materials you guys have pushed out, where I don't have to recreate the wheel. Mm -hmm. I can just throw my branding on there, my logo on it, and pass it right out. That's perfect. Mm -hmm. Hit pause on that. Are you out of here, brother?